All right, Ebba, we're back here. After that strong game last time, keep going here. Kind of personally, personally like my player better than my GM. All right, I'll probably get back to that later on. Oh, man, I don't know why, but uh, before I started this, I spent like 30 minutes kind of watching videos on YouTube about some of the older games on Nintendo 64, because that was my first system. I don't know why, I just got caught up in just looking around at the old games again, because I remember playing games like Donkey Kong 64 and Super Mario 64 and Ocarina of Time and some 3D Mortal Kombat game I forgot about. But and there was a shot yeah, it was Rockets good times. Anyways, let's get back to modern times and get playing with my player on the Atlanta Hawks. Alright. Here we go. And I'm gonna be benched. Bench mat. Oh yes. Alright, here we go. I want to see what you can do. Get hot and put up eight points or more while shooting at least sixty percent. Alright. Let's do it. And so here is Houston. Six point game. You're supposed to get two blocks this game too. Yeah, Kev, I talked to him coming out of that last huddle, and he said that coach was putting him into the game with one mission. Take over the game. Ah, oh, James Harden. God dang it. Whoa. Ah, catch him. Oh, yes. Boom. Nice. It's not easy, obviously, to turn it on in a moment to notice, but if he can pull it off, you know that the coach will look at that favorably. And the next time they're in a similar situation, guess who will get the call? And the Rockets making a change here. Lens checked in. And here's Harden for three. You know what? So Atlanta will take it the other way. They come into okay. this one having outplayed the Magic last game. I thought the way they attacked the rim and got James Harden's on me. Phenomenal. It seemed like after a while, the defense just kind of waved the white flag. That's exactly what will happen when a team continues to attack the goal and come away with layups. It demoralizes the defense. Four on the clock. A nice shot. Yes. By Teague. Teague's got his first bucket of the night. Well, Mike Boonholzer, you know, the new coach of the Hawks, spent 19 years with the San Antonio Spurs, including 17 as an assistant. Well, you couldn't ask for a better teaching ground than that. Pardon the best of Brooks. Uh, or the three. And God the dang it. Is good. Brooks has got a pick. Getting a lot of threes. For the good open look, and he splashes home the three. Here's Jenkins. And that nice. Just by Jeff T. Good shot. And back to Budenholzer, who was with the Spurs for 19 years. Steve, the Spurs, the winningest team in pro sports over the last 15 years. Yeah, I'm glad that Budenholzer has finally gotten his chance. I played for him for four seasons. He said, uh, Dang! Holy crap! They're nailing them down like nothing. Aw. Uh, I didn't want to do that. The pass to Jenkins. There's 49 seconds left to play in the first. He feeds it to Scott. Pass to Money. The Hawks need to get off a shot here. Here's Corver for three. On nice. Three, for three. Right back at you. They immediately get those three points back. Trading punches. That's how you answer. It's Harden with the drive. And you oh. have a chance to make it three. Freaking James Harden. How dare you make that shot? Box making a switch here. Beverly's checked in. The Rockets shooting their fifth free throw of the game here. Well, the season numbers for this club are really low. I mean, this is something that the team has been focusing on. They've got to improve. Guys, nice. we haven't seen the type of numbers out of them at the line that we'd come to expect, especially after last season. Harden outside. Harden gets a screen from Smith. The offensive rebound, Jones. 
tried to bank it in, but he missed it. Nice. Great job. Shoot it! Oh! Oh! Ha ha! So close. Alright, let's just keep going here. Oh, yes, I'm bitch. Alright. It's Ashik paired up in the front court without uh, Williams out there. Yeah, my way. And it's Caspi in at the three slot. That's the five for Houston right now. Brand outside. Pass to Money. Williams against Mark. Dishes at the tee. Oh. And a miss there on the triple. Another strong rebound. That's in good position. To see from them today. Yeah, one or two more of those in this lead will be double digits. Come on, come on, come on. Oh. Brooks against Mark. Here's Williams. And a look at the top single season player efficiency ratings. I love this statistic. Wilt Chamberlain. Come on. Let's miss it. Uh, oh. Oh. Okay. Yeah, you're talking Miss the shot. Uh, yes. Interesting to see a new school stat kind of juxtaposed with the old school legend. Yes. The, the rankings obviously make sense if those guys are at the top. Mike Scott's checked in for Elton Brand. Brooks gets the screen from Howard. And Brooks. Here we go. Howard kicks to Brooks. I keep jumping. No. Woo. by Jeff T. Mark some tough offensive sets. They want to turn it around. Yeah, they need a basket just to regain some more. Oh, he got stuffed. And so it looks like the he got stuffed. You can see where the Hawks rank in the league stats over the last 10 games. Really? First in shooting percentage. First in fewest turnovers a game. And they're number one in opponent scoring. They don't allow teams to get into a rhythm offensively, and thus they're able to hold those points down. And the shooting is really yes. Make a dunk on you. <laughs> job of finding open looks, they're unselfish. They work offensively to create good shots. And oh! Oh! For a solid team on the road, nothing spectacular. Really, what you'd expect from a three seed in the East end of the year with a 19-22 road record. Not bad. Look at that. Ah. Uh. Cut down now to just four points with the basket from Scott. Did you see the defense get caught standing around that time, giving up an easy second chance bucket. Simply need more of an effort on the boards there, Steve. Howard with a screen on T and Brooks. Here we go. Oh, oh, I didn't get it. No uh. nice oh, Brooks. oh, give me that. Ah, really uh. dang it. Position yourself for the playoffs. No question. As long as you can let's make these shots. Oh, boom. This is a Hawks team that's looking to take the next step. Kevin, a really yes. Lead. They've been kind of stuck in the middle for a while now. And Doris Burke has a report for us from the sideline. Gentlemen, for Jeremy Lin, two seasons ago, it was one of the most abrupt ascents into stardom the league. Uh, uh, you be that. For Lin, though, it wasn't all roses. He said, quote, I saw how fame changed how people looked at me, and I hated it. I went into a shell, but over time, I was able to get a better perspective. He said, quote, I won't let any of my friends become a fan. They can support me, but they can't treat me differently than they would treat someone yes. else. And guys, now on a new team, Lynn might just be happier now that the hoopla has settled a bit. Well, Doris, that fan passion can cut both ways. Sometimes you have to take the good with the bad. Harden outside. There's the screen. No! Ah, James Harden. Harden's got 10 points in the game. Great job of utilizing that screen and finding space to knock down the jump. Good basketball. Teague, the pass to money. No! And Jenkins. No! Jenkins dishes to Martin. The feed to Jenkins. Just fine to shoot. Jumper off the screen. Oh! oh. What did that just say? Didn't know what that said. 
that hard work on the boards needs to continue. That could be what swings this game a bit. No, 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 no. Oh, give me that ball. Well, I think he kind of alligator arm that one. Short stroke. Ah! Uh, oh. Down by two. Eh. Rockets lead. Yes, Kevin, I'm here with Dwight Howard. No, Dwight. No. To you by sprint. And it's been the Sprint Halftime Report, presented by Sprint. On Toyota Center, the scene for the right, benched. Here's Lynn. Oh. And the layup fall. Lynn's got the lead up to nine now for the Rockets. I tell you what, the defenders didn't even get a sniff of him on that move to the hoop. On the court for Atlanta, money in at power forward. Lewis Williams out there with Cunningham. Then it's Elton Brand. Oh, what the frick was that, man? What the heck was that? You passed it out of bounds. Oh, we're down by nine now. <laughs> I think in order for him to take his game to the next level, he's got to be a bigger and more consistent threat from outside. If he can home in on that three ball. I think he'll be much more difficult to defend. Here's Garcia. Oh, no. Yes. Dang. And a nice assist from Lynn. Garcia's got his. Yeah, they have the to get down the fast. Trigger. A very quick trigger on a shot. And it doesn't hesitate oh. to pull up as soon as he gets his hands on the ball. He's a very aggressive player. Oh. Well, defensive pressure is always going to be at its weakest in that instant when the pass gets there. So having a good feel for the catch. Yes. Serves him yes. Back. Assist. And for Jeremy Lin, his three-point stroke did improve right. his last season wore on. Well, once he got his legs under him, he was shooting over 40% from long range. And that's uh -huh. you're playing oh. Oh God, German is open. So good with the ball in his hands. Uh, he kicks it to Beverly. Okay, they're way back there now. Back to Lynn. Six to shoot. No. To the left wing. Tries it from 19. Yes, another rebound. The Hawks trail by eight. Brand passes. Ah, bad pass. I passed out. Brand, no wonder. Feeds to Brand. Uh, oh, oh! Pass leading to the foul. Oh, great. Elton Brian probably stinks at foul shots. He does. Screw this dude, anyways. Ugh. Man. Uh, no, don't let him in there. Lynn with it. Now guarded by Corp. Williams for three. That's ah. And the Rockets lead by 11. All right. That is not enough Reggie. coverage. You got to do better than that defensively. Ooh, yeah. Basically, no coverage. I mean, defense did not look very good there. And Brand always has played bigger than his ah. height with those long arms of his. Yeah, what the freak? They touched the ball. Screw you. Screw you. <laughs> score around the basket. But he guards the post pretty well. Al Horford, he's checked in for Elton Brand. Oh, God. Lynn, <laughs> loses his man off the Dang. screen and lays it up and in. Lynn's got six. They're straying away from the three point game here in the second half. And um, that's fine as long as they're on the lead and they're getting good shots. They decided not God to take dang it. as many three pointers in this half. Takes the 13 footer. Here's Beverly. Here's Howard. Ah! The official calls the Made me lose horrible points there. <laughs> Thanks. The energy stats, how the hustle game has been going for Houston. Their activity at the defensive end, Kevin, has been really impressive. Attacking and coming away with steals. Yeah, I think you also have to give them a lot of credit for how well they've risen up to meet shooters to challenge shots in this game. Um, a lot of oh, come on! About Shoot behind Houston's the backboard. Position. I believe with the individual rebounding talent we're seeing on the floor tonight, it's very appropriate now to take a look here at the all-time leaders in rebounding. Pretty outstanding company, isn't it, guys? Yeah, how about those names? Will Chamberlain. Ugh, get out of my face. Some of the best big men this league has ever seen. Williams with the ball. Williams picks him up. Williams attacking, and he drops him nice. up off the glass. Williams has got seven now in this quarter. 35 seconds left to play here in the third. Lynn a screen on Williams. And Garcia kicks to Howard. Howard draws the double. 
Williams against Land. Out to the right wing. This one for three. Oh, bull crap. Is good. RC has got five now. Well, they've gone on this run, and ball movement has been a big key. Yeah, they have the defense on the run right now because every pass seems to have a purpose. They're getting great movement, great spacing, and they're really lining them up defensively. Here's money. Ah, uh, I can't shoot threes. <laughs> and as we end the third quarter, a double did. Well, through three quarters of play, down double digits, it may be difficult to overcome. And now we present our State Farm assist of the game. With five total assists in the game, we've seen some great passing tonight from Brooks. And his passing ability is why they make sure... The no, 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 no. Do not let Tim score. Assist like the one we just saw. All fueled up and ready to go. Let's reset the lineups courtesy of Gatorade for the fourth quarter. And so in the game for the Rockets. Brooks out there with Isaiah Cannon. Then it's hard. Ah. And it's hard. Dang, and it's eh? Houston making a Playing defense a lot this game. game. For the Houston Rockets, they come in off a good outing against Memphis. Brooks dishes to Hart. Back to Brooks. Get out of my way! Ah! Uh. The basket on the assist by Brooks. 17 points for James Harden. He with very little pressure on their perimeter shooters. Three of the last five baskets they've allowed of the three-point variety. Yeah, and unless they make some rotations and closeouts defensively, there you there's go. more to come, Clark. Boy, nice work. Now we're down by a to good 20 anyways. A big defender Might as well like try that. to now raise my score up. And creativity, Steve, uh, particularly on the release to make sure he doesn't get a hand. Whoa. And there's the call on Lewis Williams. Dang, my guys look ball like a bunch of idiots yeah. this game. Kevin <laughs> Brands checked in for Atlanta. A little over a minute of the fourth quarter gone right now. Houston moving the ball around. Dang, man, they're scoring all every time. Three balls. They're finding holes in this defense. It should be easy to correct though if you start making the right rotations defensively. Williams attacking. Outside T. Pass to Brand. Tipped away. Holy crap! With Brooks running it up the court. Oh, wow. Oh, the freak. <laughs> Money. Money's got six rebounds now in the game. Here's Millsap. And it's Holy crap. Grand passes to Money. Goes back up. Ah, oh, now I missed two. God damn it. For the Houston Rockets, they won their last contest in that game against the Grizzlies in Memphis. Yes! Stole from James Harden. Yes. And it's Williams finishing it off. Yes. <laughs> you know, the instant that steal was made, they were off and running the other way. Ball pressure, then a run out. See, that's perfection to me. It's Harden with the drive. Brooks. Oh God. No. Ah. What a final quarter they're having from downtown. Just freeze raining in from everywhere. Yeah, work that perimeter. Work it good, and they might as well milk it while they're hot. Here's Money. He's covered by Asha. There's the dish to Williams. The pass to Money. God damn it. Blocked. Here's Caspi. Holy crap. They're making every shot here. Without any thought, without any agenda. It's hard to overstate all the points they've scored on assist today. Beautiful to watch. Brand against Howard. No good ah, I can't get it. Great defense in the paint there, making it tough on the offense. That's what he brings, a presence. I mean, you saw it on that miss. Harden kicks to Brooks. He dishes it to Howard. From deep, Harden. God dang it. Passes it to Caspi. He feeds it to Ash. No good. Great D that time for money. Hawks have gone just 33% from the field in the fourth quarter so far. They are two of six. <coughs> drops, and it comes off an assist from Williams. Eight points for money. Well, we've seen that. Uh, bucket in the lane. Yeah, the interior defense simply has been lifeless. Power dishes to Brooks. 
Over to the left wing. Three for Caspi. Oh, uh -huh. holy good. crap. Caspi's got eight points here in this quarter. I don't get any chairs for any rebounds. And the defense Caspi. getting bombarded. They just haven't been able to slow him down. Here's money. Ah. And lots of contact there. Missing the shot. He'll shoot two. And he's one player who doesn't need a lot of space to get to the basket. He's really crafty. The way he can blast his way straight through traffic. Ah. Really strong. And another skill that sets him apart, his success rate on catch and shoot jumpers. It's not every player that has such a great feel for that particular shot. And the Hawks with the complete. Ah. <laughs> here's what's up coming now for the Hawks. Following this one, they get to host the Mavericks. That game will be a quick pit stop before hitting the road again. Miss! Oh. Good from Bitten miss. Or I'll miss that song. Miss it! Uh. For Atlanta, they've got 3 of 7 from the 4 in the 4th. That's a 42% mark in the quarter. Here's Cunningham. Nice. I'm not sure that's still down a by well, too good a look to freaking for 25 <laughs> on their field goal attempt since the start of the fourth quarter. Kicks to Jones. No, the oh. the low post is good. So it's Atlanta now. Cunningham passes to money. To the paint, here's Scott. And that one goes. Nice. As he is fouled. It'll be three points if he converts at the line. They're forcing the ball inside. And it's there you working go. beautiful. Yeah, the defense has been futile here. Five of the last six field goals in the lane. Rockets have gone seven of ten shooting the ball since the start of the fourth quarter. Left side Jones. And yes! But he recovers it. I got the social media challenge. Yes. Shot clock at five. Houston needs to get a shot. A second chance effort. Good. Oh. The Hawks have gone five for nine from the field in the final quarter so far. Cunningham wishes it to Martin. Carroll passes to Money. And he there you go. The on the way. I like the way they got the ball inside there. The Rockets have gotten exactly two thirds of their shots to find. Yeah, we're only down by 24 points. It's all good. Oh yes! Yes! Outside, Mark. Oh god! And it's out of bounds for the Hawks as Atlanta retains possession. Yeah, so close to picking that pass off, guys. At least he got a hand on it. He did what he needed to do to make sure it didn't hit the target. Uh, uh. Outside. Scott. Yeah, that guy. Lock at six. Bonnie passes to Cunningham. Yes! A plus! Yes! Even though we lost horribly. Passing there to make that hoop possible. Here's Beverly. Rebounded by the Hawks. Money's got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. And so it's going to end up in the record books as a blowout. Dominating performance for Houston. And they could do no wrong today, Steve. That's right. This was a team performance. Guys, very tight. Oh! No! Too. A game to remember, <laughs> and on the other side, definitely one you want to forget as soon as possible. And so that moves their record to 11 wins on the year. Fantastic show put on. What an amazing game yes. all around it was for Dwight Howard. You have to love the way that he was closing out defensive trips. I mean, he would always body up and really be physical. I hate being on the outside. I can't block it. Cannon kicks to Beverly. 53 seconds left here in the fourth quarter. That's good. See, it's always when I can not when I'm not inside, they make it most of the time. He had a nice spurt to polish this one off. Here's Cunningham. Another three for Atlanta. It's interesting. They're like a different team now. Suddenly they've got energy. You know, it's not gonna change it. Now I guess tied. <laughs> They're losing margin a little more respectable. Cannon, the vast of Smith. Jones with the screen on Martin. Cannon kicks to Jones. 
Beautiful. Ah. Goes down. And the Rockets lead by 21. And the fans loving what's transpired here tonight. A really good victory for these guys. Sure was. I mean, they did just what they needed to do to keep the visitors from getting any momentum going at all. Shoots. And again, it's Atlanta. He's not their first option, but not a bad fallback either. And we got crushed by 19 points. Ugh. Couldn't get any of my dynamic goals this time around. Not at all. I mean, they showed up not just to play. They showed up to give great effort and to win, and they did both. And time now to go courtside as we... Yes, I'm here with... Yeah, I've tried to play my best. 413. Well, that's what back to back eight plus games now. Hey, coach, you wanted to see me? I did take a seat. So, what happened out there? I, I got an A plus. That was a great opportunity to show me what you could do. But I, I went ahead and got an A plus, though, yeah, buddy. I know. It didn't really go how I expected it to. Well, I got an A plus, though. I got 13 points. It's like an average. I did better than most of the other guy. What's this dude yeah, talking hey, about? Coach. Hey, I'll do better next time out. Wow, dude, I did better than all the other guys. That is really stupid. Okay, I get it. I mean, I, I can't say I'm happy about it, but I understand. So I'm just gonna have to go out there and. Wow. Order to change your mind. I guess apparently they want me to shoot more, I guess. Okay. Well, apparently they want me to shoot it a lot. Thanks, Coach. So, all right, I can do that. I just wanted to go ahead and help out the team, but all right. I still have 28 minutes, so that's how much I did have before. Huh. All right. <laughs> Didn't even do anything. <laughs> All right, I guess we'll use a couple of them points. We got that game. I don't know how it was an ugly game for me. All right. <laughs> All right, let's do some upgrading. So, what should we upgrade this time around? Uh, I'm trying to think, what did I do? Couldn't get really. Well, my stamina, I guess. I have some more stamina. I got tired by the end of that game. I'll do plus six for stamina. <coughs> get stamina up there. Alright, acid. Awesome. Okay.